investing in uh, Jordan and he started to build some defense to help the people of uh, Jordan. And as uh, we see in this story, the old man uh, whom he borrowed the money, I believe he had a BMW. He said, I will help these people, I will help the Jordanians. Don't ask me where I got the money, but uh, what's important is I have it and I'm helping you. So to start our meditation today, because our meditation based on the Beatitudes, how can we make our priesthood great again? Um, from our small dreams, from the great plans of God, the question is how can we make our priesthood great again? According to the plan of God. Like in the, the campaign for me, Donald Trump, lagi niyang sinasabi, we will make America great again. So, with that uh, same uh, proposition, I would like to say, we will make our priesthood great again. Amen? Amen. 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 So, paano natin gagawin ito? In, uh, in this uh, mountain where Jesus preached the Beatitudes, many people were following him, oppressed, poor, lowly, the hungry, the sick, and if they consider all people who were um, abandoned, uh, no sense of value in their lives anymore. What they were expecting from this is something new. No, anong bagong sasabihin ito? And you see, my dear friends, my dear uh, brother priest, the big thing that Jesus did for these people he elevated the standards of all these people. Napakaramdam nila, wala nang kaysayang buhay. And when he started preaching, Blessed are you um, uh, who are poor in the spirit. And all the Beatitudes, after saying that, I think, para sa mga taong nakikinig, it's a big question. How do you say we are great? How do you say we are happy? How do you say we are blessed? We are poor. That is the complete change of thought of the people na sabihin, mapalad kayo. Para bang uh, isang magandang bagay na ginawa ng Panginoon on that moment, kayong wala ng pag-asa, kayong wala ng tingin sarili, you were already uh, forgotten. At this very moment, I tell you, you are blessed. You are happy. Mapalad kayo. So, that is one big a uh, very significant words that they listen from our Lord Jesus Christ. At this moment, I would like to to invite you, everyone, to meditate on our priesthood that is the great plan of God. Gusto man Diyos manapili ang kanyang kaharian. Nagsimula ito sa simpleng mga alagad. Poor and uh, not known. Pero pinaas nila ang dama ng bawat isa no? just to continue the kingdom of God here on earth until the eternal life by the institution of the Holy Eucharist and the institution of the priesthood it is there in the priesthood where everything happens in the reality the great plans and dreams of God for the world sa kaparian po nangyari ang lahat na ito and that's why today I would like to invite you to reflect on the first word of the Beatitudes in Latin. Pagpasok natin ng uh, chapel, yung malaking libro, di ba? Katulad doon. Beati sunt pauperes, beati sunt asturion. All the word, beati. I would like to guide our meditations with the five letters of beati. And uh, the question is, how are we going to make our priesthood great again. With these five words, I uh, will be guided in our reflections for this day. The first word, the first letter, B stands for, I would like you to repeat with me that word. That B stands for believe. You say, brother, believe. 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 And I say, we can make our priesthood great if we believe again. Not believing in ourselves, but because uh, in many occasions when we become priests, nala natin tayo ng harit, sa atin ang lahat, tayo ng paniniwalaan, and we can do everything because I'm a priest, I'm powerful. 
But in fact, our greatness comes from the greatness of the Lord. So, time to come, in the years of the priesthood, sometimes you would think, na sa akin ang salari ang lahat, and yet it is so bad. There will come a time also that in the priesthood, as you are a priest, you would think, parang mababaw na ang pananampalataya ang Lord. Like in the, in the miracle of Lanciano, in the end of the month, every day that he celebrated Mass, sabi niya, ito pa kaya ito? Si Cristo pa kaya ito? Nangyayari ba ito? Nagiging katawan kaya ito? And that doubt, ay uh, nangyayari yung miracle of uh, transforming of the bread into the body of Christ. Ay mga pari sa atin, habang tumatagal, nananamlay parang minsan sa sariling buhay natin, nasabi natin parang mababaw na rin yung pananampalataya. It's not because we do not think about faith, but it's not ourselves. Nagihina na tayo sa pagtitiwala kasi nasa brahan ng tiwala sa sarili. On, the first, on that uh, first word, I would like to invite you that let us try to believe again in Christ. In the power of that we receive in the principles that we made ourselves great because He made us priests. Let us believe on that power. Second word, my dear brothers and sisters, letter E, that stands for elevate. We say first, elevate. Elevate. We will we'll make our priesthood great again by elevating our human nature. In the priesthood, we were simple priests. We were simple man, poor, unworthy. Lagi natin sinasabi, ako'y tagal Louisiana, wala lang makakayahan, dating uhugin na narito sa harap ng altar na iyo ordinahan. And look at me. I'm going back to the human nature. In the one movie says, we are humans, we are not savages. <laughs> Bakit minsan dumarating sa punto ang pari mismo yung naging hayop? Nakin naalala ko yung kwento ni Father Mark. An old priest who already died. He shared that Mario, Mario, lika. Ito, sinaristang bata, ano ha? Sino yung bata yun? Grade 4. Nalimisiklet ka. Sa kasyon. So bakit po? Abo? Okay. Nakakasin? Sila yun siya? Grade 4. Sabi nga ni Father Mario, sinarista pa sila. So bad, ano? Sa kanday, bata ko na. That, that, that kind of attitude na bakit kaya dumarating sa punto we live like we were savings we were not humans pagkain, you know, sobra na kumukuha pa diba? lahat na makita gusto mong bilaan bakit na gusto mong kainin is mine you know? so, that means uh, we are putting ourselves once again that greatness of the priesthood we are putting it down in the forest of years because we already have money. We can buy everything. We can do anything. And that without controlling ourselves, without controlling our emotions, we are becoming, once again, not already homo sapiens, we are becoming homo sentient. And so in this time of meditation, sinasabi ulit ang Panginoon, elevate you, once again, that full human creature that you are. The third Letter, my dear fathers, A, Biati. Biati. A is uh, activate. What do you say? Activate. We'll activate again. Our lost zeal or our postulate. Pag na kinulang na ng kasulina, kinulang na ng lakas para tayo become so passive in our ministry. Before we can celebrate three, four masses in a day, in my decariate before, we can not think about in the party celebrating eight masses a day. Wow. And I'm going to put in the party, I'm going to be guy. So happy. As we go all the course of the years, we start by the sun, we have a tamarana, so no lamb. Before you offered yourself, ako na po magsisikol. Pero ngayon, turo na lang. Baka 
Sinario masih sih orang paling Sinario Jodoh Or maybe you go to residence The bishop is also willing to have the Why? It's loss of seal We are made for the soul And nawawala uh, yung Yung that activity that is intended for the soul. And so in this meditation, I would like to invite you, my dear brother, please, to make him pass it to Let us activate again the seal of apostolate. The last letter, I know, sorry, the fourth letter. What's the fourth letter? Lester? P. Pitoy. 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 Good. Kanina, meron tayong an hour bus. He started a shepherding of the road. We remember the preaching of our Lord about the good pastor, the good shepherd, and that word when Peter returned back after committing most sins, and he asked, the Lord asked him, do you love me? Yes, Lord, I love you with my love. Do you love me? Yes, Lord, I love you with my love. My dear friends, the letter P stands for tending the sheep. Tend. 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 Tend your sheep. Take care of your sons. Tend your sheep. Pinagkatiwala ng Panginoon sa atin ng mga kaliwa. Alagaan natin sila. Hanapin natin sila. We look for the poor. We look for everyone. We look for the poor. We look for our friends. We become priests for everyone. Baka hindi na tayo nagmimisa sa barangay. Baka hindi na tayo nagsisikol sa mga sakop natin. Baka hindi na rin tayo nauupo para magpumpusal. These are our flock. They are the souls entrusted to us. So, my dear friends, the invitation is we can make our pursuit if we do our duty by tending our flock. I uh, make it uh, sure that every morning before I, ma I say it now, in the Every morning I sit for confession. I'm so happy that every day merong na up, may na lord, may nagkukung kusal. And I'm happier when I hear come across with a penitent who has not who has not got the confession for 20 years, 25 years, 30 years. Para sa akin big fish yon. And I end up being so happy. Sabi ko, oh my goodness, yung mga napapadaan lang ito yung may tarot kusal. I'm so happy with that. And that means that it's tending our flock. Siguro po, ngayon nasa retreat tayo, balikan natin, gano'ng karaming kaluluwa ang nakatalaga sa'yo. And how many of them, maybe you're so choosy, that you can only select friends, then factors, and sponsors, and we forget the love. So, tend your flock. And the last word, my dear friends, letter I, Iko. Ito'y again. Ito'y. Ito'y. That I stands for interiorize. Interiorize. And I would like to invite everybody that kapag bumabaw na yung ating relationship with God, interiorization would also mean our prayer life, the unity of life. When we put ourselves only on the temporal aspect and we forget our own life, we start uh, we see stop praying, and my dear friends, as we stop praying, then begins the problem. Kaya napakahalaga bawat bagay na ginagawa natin, we begin with our prayer, we theorize everything in our activities, in our plans, in every idea that we have, that is not sa pananangin, uh, yung mga under the cathedral, priests, brothers, seminarians, deacons, I uh, invite them always for common prayers. Sabi ko, masanay kayo, kahit kahit pagod, kahit kahit kuya, you wake up and we come together for prayer. Because that is a very important part of life of the priest. My dear friends, now we would like to make our prison great again. And we'll make it referring to the five letters and we would like to repeat that five words. Letter B stands for Believe. Better in stands for Elevate. And A stands for Activate. P stands for Pitoy. And S stands for Pitoy. My dear friends, we will be feeling our feet and we will be going home happy. We will be going home great because we allow the spirit to move us 
again, and elevate us again, debate the Holy Spirit, debate the Holy Spirit.